ISIL forces have called for the systematic destruction of Yazidi people, which would constitute genocide. They killed most of her family and they made her their slave. She managed to escape, but thousands of women are still being held, which is why Nadia Morad is campaigning to try to get the world to notice and do something. If starting today, you'd learn one quote about change a day in one year you'd probably be the right person to teach a university course about change. This is your host Amelia and today we explore the amazing realm of the scientific miracles. There are as many miracles in the scientific world as there are in the Buddhist religion, that is none. However, there are scientific miracles if you have the patience and diligence to work and wait for them to take place. The scientific miracles are not only possible but they are an important part of our lives, explaining things like our failure or success, war and peace, mass shootings and Nobel Prizes. For instance, if somebody would have told Nadia Murad a few years ago that she will escape the ISIS-controlled territory and never be a sex slave again she'd probably not have believed. Also, she'd never have believed that she will be the next Nobel Prize winner. But her choices brought her here. She has chosen to be brave, to keep the faith, run away and speak about all the things she's been through. And this is a miracle. A year has passed since the most terrifying mass shooting in American recent history. Las Vegas mass shooting might still be a mystery as to what motivated the shooter to plan and execute his horrific mission that left behind so much pain and so many grieving families. But if somebody would have told the shooter, when he was seven years old that he will reach to do something like that he'd probably not have believed either. What happens between the flapping of a butterfly wing in Brazil and the hurricane in Texas is a complex process. But turns out the small changes in the initial conditions always create significantly different outcomes. All the systems are defined by their parameters and when the parameters change, the whole system changes, too. An experiment made by a few engineers attempted to reproduce the flying house from the Disney movie, Up. They thought it would be next to impossible to make a house fly but they asked themselves, wait, how hard can it be? They built the house and they started filling hundreds of balloons with helium. The tension was mounting but when the balloons reached the critical mass the house started rising. As a famous commercial put it, it's only crazy until you do it. The flying house experiment proves that miracles are possible when we dare and ask ourselves how hard can it be when we plan and act with patience and diligence in order to make the miracle happen. The main reason such miracles are rather realistic and possible is the human attitude. A small but consistent change of attitude is able to change a system to the point of making it unrecognizable. 
The fundamental parameter of a human psychological system is its attitude. The scientific miracles are subtle and involve vision, will, motivation and a good time management. They are also healthy because they grant us the possibility to prepare for the occurrence of a miracle. A sudden miracle would be a deeply traumatic experience even if they may represent actual wishes that come true. Not being prepared for that big of a change it's been repeatedly proven to be one of the most challenging instances. Working for a miracle builds the character and it's a growing experience. Nevertheless, we must understand that even though we're not making any growing effort we are still moving towards some miracle. The change is the only constant in the universe. Therefore it's up to us to choose the miracle we want to live and adopt the right attitude in order to make it happen. But hope stayed afloat just long enough. It is appropriate. Until finally, so long, boys. like in the movie, the house began to rise and rise.